Hey everyone, it's Lexis. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make pineapple Hawaiian vegan shish kebab. So for the wet ingredients, we're just going to mix up everything in the saucepan at low heat. I'm going to use one third cup of ketchup, one third cup of packed dark brown sugar, one third cup of low sodium soy sauce, one fourth cup of canned pineapple juice, four tablespoons of olive oil, one and a half tablespoons of rice vinegar, four garlic cloves, or four teaspoons of minced garlic, one tablespoon of minced ginger, a half a teaspoon of sesame oil, and a few shakes of black pepper. And you're just gonna mix that all up and also add one tablespoon of cornstarch so it can get thick. And that's how it should look when it's done. So now we're going to move on to our shish kebabs. I have potatoes, red green peppers, red onions, and some vegan sausage. I'm using the tofurkey kielbasa sausage. And I'm just going to put it all on the stick. Make sure that you soak your shish kebab sticks so they don't burn on the grill. So we're going to make sure that the flame is low and that you spray your aluminum foil so, so that it doesn't stick. Now we're just going to take the sauce and we're going to spread the mixture over the shish kebab. We're going to flip them over and do the same thing. We're going to let that cook for about 10 minutes on each side. This is the next batch. This makes a lot of shish kebabs. I only make half of the batch, but it makes like double the amount. So when it's done, we're going to pour our remaining sauce over it, over the rest of the shish kebabs. And you find yourself a pretty tray like this one, and you just lay the shish kebabs on it. And it's perfect for a barbecue, a party, a picnic, anything. These are the perfect summer shish kebabs. And there we have it, vegan Hawaiian pineapple shish kebabs. Hope you enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.